What's up, you guys? This is Divine Messenger 33, where I get messages from the divine. I give them straight to you guys. So clearing out any energy that would not benefit this message. Holy Spirit, Archangel Michael, my ancestors and spirit guides of my highest good, please come in and protect me as I channel. These current messages for the collective ancestors of my highest good, please give me clear and accurate messages. Thank you guys for all the likes, the shares, the comments, the subscribes, the emails, the bookings, the donations. I appreciate you guys for all the love and the support you show to me and the channel. I appreciate you. And all the other information about me with the other platforms I am on will be down below in the description box. All right, you guys. All right. So I have still been getting like some people still do not know that I have a second channel. So yes, Karmic Endings is my other channel, okay? There are people still confused. So yes, I do have another tarot channel, okay? So yes, that's me. Because <laughs> I'm, you know, people say, well, this voice sound familiar or, you know, or something like that. So yes, that's me, <laughs> okay? I do have two channels, okay? Karmic Endings 1010, and I have this one, Okay. <laughs> All right, so let's get into it, you guys, and see what is going on, what you should know at this time, okay? All right, let's see, y'all. Let's see what's going on. One more. What's going on, spirit? Happy single, period. For some of y'all, you could be single or you could be newly single. Or for some of y'all, you single and you happy about it. Shit, career focused, setting goals, doing you, stress-free. For some of y'all, you could have a family or something like that, period. Okay, you just doing you. Yeah. Yep, somebody closed a cycle here. Somebody could have learned the lesson and they closed the cycle. Yeah, something is shattered here when it comes to a romance. It's shattered, okay? Somebody is now single and they closing the cycle because something has been shattered. So let's get into it and see what is going on, y'all. What's going on, collective? Let's see, collective. What's up? <laughs> Some things is shattered here, yo. I'm hearing somebody want to get closer to you. Y'all, what's on right now is Put It On You by Applause featuring <laughs> Chris J. <laughs> Woo! Somebody is like, listen, I want to put that on you. Put it, put it on you. That's funny. What's going on, you? Yeah, three of wands. Somebody now looking towards a future. Something to do with Aries. Okay. <laughs> Six of wands and eight of cups. Yeah, for some of y'all, you got somebody attention. But it's like, as soon as this person start paying attention to you, you walked away. So it's like, right when this person made a decision to close the cycle on something, it's like, you walking away now. Leo, Aries, or Pisces. Okay, or something like that. Or something to do with those signs could be very significant. Yeah, Three of Swords. Somebody is heartbroken here. Yep. Somebody could feel like something is too late. Okay, or something. Yep, Queen of Pentacles. Page of Wands. For some of y'all, you're going to get a message while you're at work from this person. Or while, while ever you do for work, it's like this person going to message you. For some of y'all, because it's like this Queen of Pentacles, this person's focusing on herself, self-love. Okay, man or woman. It's like you just really focusing on you. But for some of y'all, whoever this person is, they're going to message you while you're at work. Yep, you're going to be working and you're going to get this message from this person. Or you're going to be doing something that you do for work and you're going to look at your phone and be like, what? <laughs> you're going to be like, what the hell? <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, they gonna message you, collective. They show sure is. You got Sagittarius, Capricorn, Libra, Pisces, Leo, Aries. Yeah, this person is gonna message you, yo. <laughs> you gonna be like, what the hell? You are not gonna expect this, is what I'm hearing. You're not gonna expect this, collective. I'm hearing I broke up with the hoe. <laughs> I ended it with the hoe. Okay. <laughs> What's the three of wands? What's the three of wands, yo? Yep, something to do with a travel. Something that can be like long distance. Something to do with a cancer. Yeah, but whoever this person is, it's like, this person is, is making a very like logical decision, I feel. Like this person is like really like, they not in their feelings trying to make the decision or nothing. This person is like, look, this makes sense. This is this. This is that, you know, kind of energy. What's the six of wands? So this part, this is giving me like a cat mouse energy, runner chaser vibes. It's like right when you turned your back, now this person like, oh, you got my attention. And for some of y'all, you just turning your back and just doing you. It's like, you're not even focusing on this shit no more. It's like, all right. I see where it's at. I'm not going to continue to entertain this bullshit. And for some of y'all, it's like right when you did that, this person is like, nah, they want to pay attention to you. <laughs> nah, they want to pay attention. What's the six of wands? King of Pentacles. Yeah, whoever this person is, they not backing down, I feel. No, they're not. Because this person know that you that you're theirs. I'm just hearing that. Somebody feel like that you are theirs. <laughs> so it's like this person ain't backing down from you. Cause they they just feel like y'all belong together. So this person is not trying to give up, you know, like kind of energy. They is like, okay, yeah. Like whoever this person is, it's like they understand though why you in this energy. It's like they understand why you just like, all right, I'm going to just emotionally detach from this, even though this hurt me, but I'm going to just go ahead on and focus on myself and, you know, just do me and what made me happy. And for some of y'all, it's like, right when you not even thinking about it, here, here they come. Here they come. <laughs> it's like, here they come, yo. For some of y'all, somebody want to come to you as a woman. Here we go with this shit. Somebody want to come to you as a woman. This hoe better keep her ass over there. You don't, you ain't got to come to nobody as a woman. Okay? Keep your ass over there. <laughs> okay? That's that's what I'm hearing. What's the Eight of Cups? What's the Eight of Cups? Yeah, Star Card. I feel like for some of y'all, walking away from this gave you some kind of healing in some shape or form to go forward. Okay, for some of y'all, it's like you just went forward and you start, you called somebody else. I just heard <laughs> like, all right, you don't want to act right. All right, fuck it. So, okay, something like that. Something to do with a Pisces, Aquarius, Aries, Scorpio, Cancer. Somebody is like, okay, well, let me, fuck it. Seven of Cups. I'm about to just go choose another option. This for some of y'all. It's not for everybody that did this, but this somebody did did this route. Some do the Scorpio, Cancer, Aries. Somebody could have like, okay, well, I'm gonna just go ahead on and just hit up my, you know, somebody else then, since it's like that, you know, kind of energy. Now that's for somebody. What's the Three of Swords? For some of y'all, whoever this person is. They could have been trying to go through all their options because for some of y'all, somebody is like, they can't believe something with you. So it's like somebody could feel like, well, they was trying to look for better, I guess. And whoever this person is, they was looking for better, but they kept getting like hurt, backstabbed, shit wasn't working out in a situation. Like somebody just kept getting like fucked up. Okay, <laughs> shit kept backfiring in a damn face. All right, it just kept happening. What's the three of swords? Four of pentacles. Yeah, this person is hurt because they feel like you're holding back from them. 
But this person is too determined because they can't stop thinking about you. They fantasize about you all the time. This person don't know why the fuck. Well, they know why they can't get you out their head. But it's like you, you got literally when Cardi say, I got condos, you know, like living in somebody's head. Like that's the energy I'm feeling with somebody. Like this person think about you 24 seven. I don't care what the fuck they doing. Work, shitting, sleeping, eating, talking to their homeboys, whatever they doing, homegirls, whatever they doing, you are running across this person's mind every time. But this person's heartbroken because they like now they feel like they feel like you holding back. Yup. It's like damn, now that now they ready and you're like, no. <laughs> no. Like kind of energy. What's the Queen of Pentacles? Like the fuck? You the fuck you thought having me on hold. The fuck you mean? Queen of Pentacles? <laughs> you better go sit down somewhere with that shit. Queen of Pentacles. The fuck? Queen of Pentacles. Justice. This person feel like they haven't they'll have justice with you. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Libra. They feel like that they don't have justice with you here. Okay. For some of y'all, somebody is going through a divorce. Somebody is, is either they're deciding to go through with it, or this could be like a finalized something to do with um, Libra season. Okay. Something about something being finalized or something like that. Yeah. What's the uh, page of wands? What's the page of wands? Horrifying. This person want to marry you. Yeah, they do. Knight of Pentacles. For some of y'all, somebody, something about somebody getting a message from the government that's going to slow them down here and hurt them. So something about a Taurus, a Sagittarius, or a Virgo. Okay. So whoever this person is that somebody leaving behind, I just feel like somebody could have even like moved quick, married somebody and everything. But now everything is just shattered. It's like it's breaking up now. This could even be like some kind of marriage that only lasted a couple months. Like kind of energy. Like this is giving me that kind of vibe for some of y'all like. Oh, where well, somebody got married, it only lasted a couple months or not long at all. But I am seeing for some of y'all, somebody going to contact you some kind of way. I'm seeing a, a, a phone call or something come in at work while you're working. Whatever you do for work. Yep. Because I feel like that y'all are in this energy right now. You are in this energy you know, you're, you're content with, you know, your life and how it's going and going forward, you know? And it's like, for a lot of y'all, it's like, whoever this person is, I feel like when you walked away, you healed a part of yourself. Like a part of yourself was healed walking away from this person, emotionally detaching from the situation. And now this person, they want to be all in your shit okay <laughs> yeah they want to be all in your shit now that's why i just literally heard somebody want to go from being detached to being like oh they want to be in contact they want to do the most like i'm seeing somebody want to do a whole switch around in your energy if this was somebody that you felt like was was being you know whatever ways distant whatever somebody want to change the way they was dealing with you but for some of y'all you just like i ain't interested you just like i you know i was trying to give you a chance when the, when it was open but you didn't want it <laughs> you know you didn't want it you wanted other options you felt like other options was better now your ass suffering <laughs> now your ass suffering Regret and shit. Current energy. Yeah. Whoever this person is, they lack maturity. For a lot of y'all, this is very, very important. 
And that's what could have caused a whole fucked up situation with somebody lack maturity, emotionally or whatever. Yeah. But whoever this person is, not like I said, now they want to express their feelings, but it could be a missed opportunity. Because somebody could have been too self-absorbed and somebody really could have missed out. Somebody could be a barber, like somebody could cut hair. Okay. Young at heart. Yeah, you, you got a lot of like cards, like young at heart, immaturity. Whoever this person is, they are in deep thought about the situation now. Like now somebody is doing some reflection here about everything that's going on. Now this person want to be loyal and all of that. <laughs> yep. Yep. It's just... Whoever this person is, I just feel like communication was like a big thing in this situation. Somebody is bad at communicating. Somebody, you know, they just, they suck, collective. <laughs> they suck bad, okay? Somebody could be a singer. Man, this is crazy, collective. Mm. But whoever this person is, I feel like that they could have realized about a karmic partner and they could have emotionally walked away and now this person really is healing. And for some of y'all, this person is really thinking about what they put you through and they heard about it. Like somebody is really like going through some hurt about what they put you through because it's like whoever this person is, they could be going through some lessons and th they getting fucked up. And for some of y'all, this person is reflecting about what they put you through. And it's really, it's hurting them now. It's hurting them now. They thinking about it like, damn, you know what I'm saying? Look at this shit. Look what wanted to pop out. It was all sticking out and shit. Look at this shit. I'm about to put it just like this. Because this is how it's showing up. <laughs> Somebody obsessed as fuck with your ass. Obsessed, yo. This person went from, oh, I ain't gonna wanna pay them no attention, all this other shit, to now nah, this person can't take your eyes off you. If you posting anything on social media, they watching every motherfucking thing you post on every motherfucking platform. Trust me when I say, I don't give a fuck what platform you on. That motherfucker got a way of seeing some shit, okay? <laughs> they watching everything, yo. I'm telling you what I know. And for some of y'all, this person don't want you to know how obsessed they are, for real. They don't want you to know how obsessed they are, but they obsess like bad, but they don't want you to know though. You got dogs. It's crazy. It's crazy collective. Braces. Somebody can have some big feet. French tip nails. Somebody could be real small. 30s. Somebody could wear their nails short. Yeah, I'm telling y'all something real about this shit. Short curly hair, there could be an age gap. Right leg and thigh tattoos. You have 40s. You have D. Some do it a transgender. Somebody could love Nike. You got S. U. Some to do a nine or a Virgo. Life path number nine. Somebody could smoke. Some do a sleeve tattoo. You got 40s. Right leg and their thigh tattoos. Some buy some new panties. What the fuck did I say? Somebody has realized. Big chest. Backfire is on the way. Right hand. You got Z. 
something to do with the military or the navy or something like that long straight hair real or fake natural hair something to do with a mechanic you got h you got a something to do with a condo and you got joggers okay something to do with safari something to do with the sahara sarah yo something to do with d-a-s d-a-h d-a-z okay look this is crazy collective mm -hmm. something to do with arizona Something to do with Atlanta. Mm -hmm. Crazy. <laughs> That's all I gotta say. Woo! Yep, yep, yep. I mean, I'm seeing something blow up in somebody's face. Something to do with Dubai. Dubai. Okay. Something to do with Huda, H U D A. Okay. I heard Sandy. Mm. Crazy collective. Like for real, for real. Something with A D H D. Okay, I just heard that too. Yeah. <laughs> this person is sad, nah, look at this shit. Yeah, they sad about this shit. Yeah, they sad. <laughs> you got somebody sad. Somebody in huge regret. Somebody, could, something about a motorcycle or a dirt bike somebody could have. Yup, somebody is really in their feelings collective. They sad. They're sad. Womp, womp, womp. <laughs> yep. They sad, yo. All right, collective, I really hope that these messages helped you or gave you some kind of clarity in your situation. All right, I will. Man, I was about to say what I say on TikTok. <laughs> Look down in the description box below for all the services that I provide and the links available to the other platforms I am on. And until next time, peace and love.